up on Facebook Live shortly. Seltzer, Tyler watching us this morning. Lenny's got a Pacers foam finger. Pacers going to need a little hail helper Mike coming up tomorrow night. Finger, what? Too, but it's different. The finger, huh? Mike has a foam finger too, but it's different. We'll bring the uh, other foam finger tomorrow, okay? Deal? Uh, Jeremy Goan's watching this morning. Anything? Anything you guys got on your mind? My voice is still gone. I have no idea why, but what are we going to do? Dave Matthews, man, hey. See, that's why we should have brought the foam finger right there. Good morning, Heath. Good morning, Christopher. I can change channels. No, you're not changing channels with the foam finger. Uh, Dwight Freeney's going to join me later on today. Dwight Freeney was in Indy yesterday, signed a contract with the Colts to retire as a member of the Colts. Dwight Freeney, a Hall of Famer, in your opinion? What's he got, 125 and a half sacks for a career, I think? Freeney, a Hall of Famer? Hey, Heath, I'm sorry, man. She turned off Dave Matthews' band, didn't she? Good morning, Ian. Um, so we got uh, Dwight Freeney on the show later on. How do I not know this song? I've heard every single 80s song. <laughs> she has. Uh, Rick Venturi joins us later on today. And I think JJ's going to join us. I don't know if they're going to be in Cleveland yet or not, but game five is coming up tomorrow night from Cleveland uh, with that uh, series tied at two games. Peace. Uh, what we got here? JMB, that's from Jennifer. I watched LeBron forward foul steps. Uh, there's players, not a single other player violates that rule after the Rams to call it. He's done that forever, and they've never called it, but he's done that forever. Um, he likes King of Pain, too, huh? It's, it's We're not 50, going, we're not no, going it's a 50s trivia question. A 50s trivia question. All right, Laney trivia, really quick, but some 50s trivia, trivia question. When did Elvis die? This is a 50s trivia question. Now, a little hint. He did not die in the 50s. He became famous in the 50s. He didn't die in the 50s. What year did Elvis die? You. I'm asking you. Wait a minute. You, do you know that you asked the question? It's your trivia question. I'm... John Heron Chubb will not be available at 6. He's not going to make it down there. Just, uh, just answer the question, okay? Look. Carl Wagner, August 16th, 1977. Heath Bartlett, August 16, 1977. No. Chris Roberts, too early for you tequila. Are wrong. No, you we're are. not wrong. You don't even know the answer to the question you ask it. Oh. To ask trivia questions, you need to know the answer. <laughs> Jennifer says, I think they have games five and six, TNT and ESPN for the schedule I saw oh, online. But that might be the subject to change another oh, team's quiz. Yeah, you're right. It's not All right, hold on. Another Laney trivia question. Go ahead. What is um, me and Blake's favorite um, favorite episode of Looney Tunes? All right. What is Laney and Blake's favorite episode of Looney Tunes? Can we? Good morning, Mom's Connie. Good morning, John. Mom's Can we give everybody a hint here? Mom's favorite episode. Mom's favorite episode. Is it the two uh, hillbillies and Bugs? Hello. Square dancing, square dancing episode. The hillbilly square dancing, and Bugs Bunny dressed up as the girl, and right, promenade on the floor. Yeah, that, that's Mom's favorite. Oh yeah, we know that. I knew that trivia. Hillbilly hair. Thank you, Jennifer. Absolutely, hillbilly hair. It is. Um, all right. Any more trivia questions? Uh, Corey Hall says this: the one where the coyote gets crushed by the boulder every episode. I like some good Yosemite Sam stuff, though. That's always good. Yosemite Sam, the the fearless freep, where um, they're doing the the show and they're jumping from the top of the ladder down to that little bucket of water. That was a pretty good one right there, too. But the hillbilly one's hard to beat, man. It is. 
Uh, Heath Bartlett said I would have to get, get that with multiple choice. <laughs> you got any other trivia questions to ask this morning? Mm-hmm. Hey, quick question for you guys out there. Do you guys still think the Pacers can win this? Are we thumbs up or thumbs down on blue and gold moving forward? What is Blake's favorite food? What is it? Okay, hold on. Thumbs up or thumbs down on the Pacers for game five? And what's Blake's favorite food? Um, It's in a can. And you open it up out of the can, right? Second. Second favorite food? That I hate. It's Blake's favorite food that Lainey hates. I don't know what that is. I know what his favorite food is right now. Well, I, Can I say his favorite his, food right now is... Actually, his third favorite food. It's also a candy, but not jelly oh. belly. All right. Uh, no, not no. Okay. Hold on, what is this, ma'am? Hey, it's from Mike Dwyer. I know what it That's is. That's Brian in town. I just saw him at a gas station. He's signing autographs. I know what it is. Well it done. It starts with circus. <laughs> it starts with circus. Circus peanuts? Man, he doesn't like circus peanuts. Nobody does. He likes us. Mike Dwyer said the Pacers blew it. They're done. Heath Bartlett says Brussels sprouts. Blake's second favorite food is Campbell's Soup Double Noodle. What's his first? Double Noodle is his second favorite right there. Yep. What's his first? All right. Uh-oh. Brian Adams. What cut? What? <laughs> Come on, man. Seriously? Seriously, what? <laughs> I'm not saying a word. What the? Uh, <laughs> what can, <laughs> What country is Brian Adams from, lady? <laughs> what country is Brian Adams from? Alaska. Yeah, that's a state. Oh, you seriously didn't say Alaska, did you? Oh my God! Rams. It rhymes with Canada. 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 Woo! <laughs> yeah, I don't think Mike took a picture of Des Bryant signing autographs at a gas station. I don't. Uh, Davis said the Pacers win five and six. Uh, Christopher, good morning from Ocala, Florida. Good morning, Christopher. Hey, completely disregard my daughter's thinking that Alaska's a country, okay? Come on now. You're better than that. Alaska? Well, it's a state. It's yeah. a state. Stay. Oh, it's a state. Yeah, see, this foam finger Stay. crap's not working here. Foam Stay. finger's not working. Stay. Hey, Brian Crow, thank you guys. I'm going to get a Bobcat sometime here very soon, so thank you guys for being awesome at Bobcat Eventing, man. I do appreciate that. Hey, I've got a reminder here really quick, okay? Because stop hitting me the foam finger for a minute. Stop. All right, me later on today. I'm going to be live at the Big Red Liquors in Greenwood. It's brand new. It's where Madison and Madison and 31 come together at Smith Valley Road. All right. I'm going to throw it out the door and stop hitting me with it. Um. So I'll be there. We're going to sign people up for a free kegerator. Seriously, I'm going to sign up for this. I never sign up for the free stuff, but I don't even have a kegerator. you believe that? Uh, Joni Linville says my nine-year-old had one of those foam fingers, too. I'm like, you know where this foam finger is going to go in a minute? This is just beyond ridiculous. Dada is getting a little angered at this foam finger bullet crap here. Uh, so I'll be there beginning at 3 o'clock. We're going to sign people up for a lot of stuff to give away, including a kegerator later on today and a brand new Big Red Liquors. <laughs> this is what happens down here. Look, that's too bad. <laughs> um, all right, today's show. Dwight Freedy is going to join us. Is Dwight Freedy a Hall of Famer? We'll ask him that. Uh, Dwight Freedy joins us later on today. Uh, Rick Venturi later on today regarding the draft. If you're asking me right now who the the Colts are going to draft, I'm saying Quentin Nelson. Chubb is not going to get there. We'll see if they trade down. Um, That's later on today with Rick Venturi. And Jeremiah Johnson is going to join us from Fox Sports Indiana about game number five. Yeah, I know Michael Child down. We're going to have to ground some people in here. Somebody's getting grounded. All right. What else? What else you got for everybody, lady? Huh? What do you got? 
something. Have somebody something. Come on, do something. People are watching right now. They want to watch. No more trivia questions? No more trivia questions? What was the... What kind of Tom and Jerry episode does not show anything? That really doesn't show anything. What Tom and Jerry episode? It's only, there's only two. It's not too hard. Come here, whisper that in my ear. Okay, I'll tell you. No. It's the... I forgot. Alright, good. Don't ask trivia. Okay, no more trivia questions. Thank God. Why do um, you put on your wheelchair? I understand. Uh, Connie says the Pacers will win five and six. Corey Hall, did she not have any trumo this morning? We forgot. Corey Hall, this episode of Drop Off Live Sports un unofficially brought to you by True Moo. No. Huh? Hold on. 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 Is this weird about luck or not? I think this is all just kind of weird about luck, isn't it? <laughs> hey, quarter flash right here. You mm. too was playing, Lisa, in the background right there. You got it. All right. Got to run. Anything else you want to add before we go? It's time to go into school. What do you got? Nothing. Nothing. Great. Great co-host right there. <laughs> I'm going to, hey, this phone finger, I'm going to stomp it out whenever we, no more phone finger. <laughs> Phone fingers got me mad. <laughs> Is that not genius marketing or no? Exactly, Corey, yes. Uh, he probably said yes, Lisa Pride uh, from the Unforgettable Fire in 1984. That's what I was playing. This is Quarter Flash right here. Find another fool. Let's go through some stuff really quick. 70 channels got. The Eagles, best of my love. 90s channel has. Wait, we forgot to spend the dial. Hold up, up, up. I got a trivia question for everybody. You guys ready? What song was sampled in the Verve Bittersweet Symphony? And because it was not authorized by this band, the Verve received zero money for this hit. What song is it? Trivia question! Trivia question! I read Shushy Josh! Did not get paid, oh, excuse me, a dime for this song, the verb did. Not a dime for Bittersweet Symphony. Artist, band, and song. Let's go. What do you got? Scott Yeti says the Pacers attack on the Old Depot double team is terrible. Hey, I tell you what, sending the high ball screen. On a team that wants to double team at the top, all the depot is ridiculous. I completely agree with you on that. Stop it. And what, stop it right now. What are you doing? Yawning. Huh? Yawning. Yawning? You yeah. yawn on your own TV show. Yes, I can yawn no, whenever I want to. Yawn! <laughs> Chad got the Rolling Stones right. Good call, buddy. All right, we got to run here. Later on today... 3 o'clock, I'll be live on the south side, Greenwood. New Big Red Liquors location yeah. off of Madison Avenue. Join me there. Rolling Stones. Well done, everybody. Love you guys. Drop off on Sports Lenny. Say goodbye to everybody. Thank you for watching. I think Victor Oladipo tomorrow, by the way, is going to have a huge, huge game tomorrow night. I do. Don't yeah. ride them off yet. There's no need. Drop off line sports. Thank you, Bobcat of Indy. And just, um, just, just, no thanks to the unofficial sponsor of this show, The Beverage, because they're not sponsoring it yet, but we still drink it every morning. Have a great day.